Seems very efficient, striping it Here from we distance. Well, it's the name of the game nowadays. The math is unavoidable. If you can't space the floor, you get left behind. Now the starting group for the visitors. They've got John Conchar. He's out there with Aaron Holiday. Bruce Brown is out there with Tony Bradley. And it's Bates Diop in at the four-man position. Bledsoe for three. Bates Diop with a rebound. Here's Bradley. Holiday from long range. That one no good. It's stolen by Holiday. Inside, here's Bates Diop. Stolen by Bledsoe. It's a one on one situation. Here's Lillard. Another miss. He's 0 for 2 now. Pass to Bates Diop. Jacks up a three. They get it again. Tries again. And Brown with the layup. At the end of the day, when the ball goes up, there's no substitute for effort. Here's Eubanks. Here's Lillard. Back to Eubanks. Well timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. And we know Lillard can score, but he's showing nice awareness with the pass to his open teammate. Holiday, count the basket. Holiday. Just taking it right to the rim, and no one was there to greet him. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now here's Bledsoe. Eubanks the screen. And that one makes him two for two. He's in his rhythm. What vision from Bledsoe. A point who can score it and dish it. Well, you want to talk loaded college teams? Eric Bledsoe played with some serious talent during his one year in school. Bledsoe went 18th overall in the 2010 draft. He was the fourth selection from his school. Now, John Wall went first overall, DeMarcus Cousins fifth, and Patrick Patterson 14th. I'm happy I never had to face that squad when I was in college. Pass to Holiday. He buries it from three. Holiday's got five points. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. Now here's Lillard. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. Conchar pulls it in. On the wing, Holiday. Down low. Here's Bates Diop. Second chance effort. Gets another look. Bradley misses. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession. Except for the result. Here's Bledsoe. Bates Diop with a rebound. Here's Bradley. The shot. Wasted no time with that shot, but it's off the mark. And at a certain point, you just have to look to someone else to score for you. Shot's good by Bledsoe. The defense decides to gamble off him, and he cashes in. It's Holiday with a drive. Shot from 12. Bradley misses. And he just hasn't been able to get it going this period. And you've seen they've made numerous attempts to try to get him going. Shows how valuable he is to this offense. Beautiful location on the pass, as usual. Led his man perfectly. Who wants a teacher? Make a little noise. Your blazer dancer. He's checked in for Little. Hart comes in for Bledsoe. And Simon has subbed in for Lillard. And here in the first quarter, a little over three and a half minutes play. No good on the three. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Ingles with it. Now guarded by Brown. The shot by Eubanks, no good. Pass to Brown. Beyond the arc. Sinks it from Bruce distance. Brown. Brown's Three. got five points. 
He made the most of that opening, teaching the defense a lesson. Outside, Ingles. Back to Simons. Yeah, he tried to gain position, but couldn't quite get there. Mclemore's checked in for Portland. Ben Mclemore. Simons with a three, drains the triple. Eyes up, scanning the floor. Winslow plays with great poise and unselfishness. Releases. Oh, not wasting any time and taking the shot and hitting it. And here is Ingles. Outside Winslow. Pass to McLemore. Here's Simons. Another one falls for Portland. He's a go-to guy for them because he's that consistent. Time and time again, he delivers. Two minutes. Here's Conchar. He's covered by Hart. Two minutes. Outside, Brown. Watford. Yep, that one's good. Brendan Great Watford. job executing the offense. That pass on time. And on point. 144 left in the first quarter of the game. Outside Hart. Here's Simons. He's got five. Pass to Winslow. From behind the arc. Conchar pulls it in. Conchar's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Simons. Inside. Tipped. Here's Winslow. He's looking good. That's Two buckets in three attempts. The sneaky touch from Winslow there. Nice work using the floater to hurt the D. Here's Brown. Carries it down low. Brown's got his third bucket of the night. That's a chance he's never going to pass up. The D completely ineffective. The floater deflected. And he recovers it. And it's Simons missing. There's 48 seconds left to play in the first. Pass to Wagner. Oh, the go-ahead bucket, no good. Won't see him miss that one too many times. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. There's the triple. Conchar can't hit. Now Ingles. Winslow up top. To the inside, Simons. And the layup is good. Simons got seven. Great pass by Winslow. You see his leadership skills even at a very young age. Five on three break. And here's Simons outside. Sinks the tray. And now a five-point Portland lead. The value of good ball movement isn't lost on this squad. And the ball out of play. The Trailblazers will have it. Boy, if you're the coach, you hate to see that kind of miscommunication between your guys. The baskets were coming early and often in the first quarter. It's the Trailblazers up five. Stay with us now as we get set to bring you quarter number two after this. Your Blazer Dancer. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for Portland? It looks like they're ready to run today, fellas. They keep getting out on the break whenever they can. One thing I've also noticed is how quick their hands have been tonight. Thanks to that, they've gotten a lot of points off turnovers. We've got O'Shea for set, and it's Bates Diop in at the three. Eubanks the screen. Dunn right side. Second chance shot. Eubanks gets the bucket. Six points for him. The defense getting out hustled on the putback. Can't let that happen. For some reason, blocking out has become a lost art, and that's the result you'll get. Oh, wasted no time on that one. 
Unselfish, moving the ball. Love to see this kind of offense. Pass to Eubanks. Lillard outside. Eubanks the screen. And Lillard, here we go. And it goes. As the official calls the foul. Count it. And he'll shoot one more at the line. And every year, Grant, the officials seem to emphasize a different rule. Do you think it takes long for players to adjust? You know, B.A., it depends on the rule and how strict they will call it. Things like the rip through, hand checking, those type of rules, they take some time to adjust. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Bledsoe's checked in. And we played just over a minute of basketball in the second quarter. The three, here's Lillard. The rebound by Brissett. We've got a close game here in Portland. This game coming after a loss versus the Raptors. They failed to create enough good looks. The ball movement just wasn't quite where it needed to be. You know, they take one step forward, two steps back, and exercise and frustration. Now here's Bledsoe. It's hard on the wing. Six to shoot. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. They're punishing those late defensive rotations. Getting good looks inside throughout the half. To the paint. Here's Coffee. That one falls. Nice Amir feed that time Coffee. from Holiday. You have to be accurate there. Very little room for error passing on the interior. Pass to Eubanks. Lillard against Holiday. And he comes up with a bucket. Lillard's got five and force feeding the ball inside. I mean, no reason to go away from what's working. Here's Brissett. Three-pointer. And Bledsoe pulls it down. Portland leading. Lillard got a good look. And it's Portland with another. In terms of shots per game, Lillard's name is always near the top of the list. He's not going to hesitate if the shot's there for him. Holiday from long range. And he drains it. A solid five for six now. This defense just can't stay connected to shooters. Who wants a t-shirt? Your Blazer dancer. Check the numbers for Justice Winslow. And here are the Trailblazers now. Here's Lillard. And the dunk by Lillard. The defense gets cut to shreds by Lillard on the drive. He's just so quick and agile. Holiday will not go. Misses off the front iron. You know, Josh Hart won't wow you with the scoring or flashy plays, but he does all the little things for his team. A 6 5 team. Hart was one of the best rebounders in the league in the 2021 season. That number really jumps out at you for someone his height. already gets the three ball to go and now an eight point portland lead <laughs> they're simply not missing unreal good shooting can be contagious you see the confidence running through this team right now now when we talk about hard spinning he's been underrated it seems from the moment he entered the league you're right ba playing four years in college he was the final pick of the 2017 first round what a value pick that's turned out to be Jason's outperformed a bunch of guys who went in the top team. Get a free t-shirt. Let's see it, friends. All right, look who's coming out on the court. Come on, give it up for your laser dancer. For the Trailblazers, Winslow's checked in for Eubanks. Ingles comes in for Hart. And Simon has subbed in for Bledsoe. 
Every trip up the floor gets more and more important. Yes, indeed. They badly want to stop the bleeding here. Aaron Holiday. And the basket by Holiday. Trying to slice into this deficit every time up the floor. Terrific quarter for him. And once Lillard kicks it up a notch, watch out. Flat out taking over now. Lillard's gotten 6 of 10 from the floor. Very efficient. Back to Holiday. The three. The shot misses. So the Trailblazers will take it the other way. Pass to Simons. Wide open look. And that one drops. And it comes off an assist from Ingles. Simons got 12. He drops yet another dive. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Here's Holiday. And score it. That now makes him 7 for 11 in this game. Taking things into his own hands this quarter. Trying to keep his team afloat. Over to the left wing. Pass to Little. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. The rebound by Brissett. Two minutes remaining. Right wing. Two minutes. To the middle. Outside Holiday. Three-pointer. Again, Holiday missing. And here's the fast break. Lillard passes to Ingles. There's a minute 40 left in the first half of basketball. And the dunk by Lillard. All the way up. Mercy. <laughs> Lillard throwing it down. Pass to Bates Dia. Shoots over Ingles. Chops one in from the wing. And they're in a better flow this quarter offensively. And their shooting percentage is steadily rising as a result. Outside, Ingles. Here's Little. Dunks it down. Wow, that type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch, that's certainly a big time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. And yep, it's good. There's 47 seconds left to play in the half. From 10 feet away, and that one hits the back iron. Back to Wagner. Pass to Coffey. Here's Brissett. Tries again. And it's Little with a rebound. I mean, all period, it's been a struggle for him scoring the ball. And here is Winslow. 15 seconds left in the first half. And it falls for him. He's hit three of his first four attempts. Setting each other up beautifully. I love it. Eight of their last ten points coming off assist. And the basket by Coffee. Give him eight. Attacking the defense with the pass. Don't need to be a hero. Lillard fires away from way outside. And they waste no time getting those three points back. Just a big-time answer from Lillard. He competes as hard as anyone in this league. Just a big-time effort for Damian Lillard, providing a lot of energy for Portland. An insane quarter. No one could stop him. Time for a quick break, then back to the action. Hey, everybody. Shaq, do you know what time it is? Nope. It's time to check out the early season NBA Power Rankings. And here's the trivia question for the night. Who makes the power rankings? The good people at NBA 2K, of course. I think they could use someone with a little more knowledge, someone like the big Aristotle. You'd really want to spend your time creating the power rankings. Yes, I would. I don't think so. I don't think so. All right, and guys, we got to talk about Damian Lillard. He's had an outstanding half. You're right, Ernie. Look at the numbers. His impressive point contribution speaks for itself. He's put the team on his back on the offensive end, of course. And he's saying, hey, follow me. And that's it for halftime. Thank you for joining us. We send you back to Brian Anderson for the start of the third quarter.
big gap on the scoreboard. The second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to protect their lead. What a game we're seeing from Damian Lillard. What makes him an exciting player is the ultra-aggressive mindset that we saw over and over in the first half. And not standing around, not settling for perimeter shots. He's looking to attack. We've got Damian Lillard, Drew Eubanks out there with Justice Winslow. Then there's Eric Bledsoe, and it's Little in at the three, the small forward. That's the group in the game for the Trailblazers. Nails it from beyond the arc. Conchar's got himself on the board with a three there. Poor defense there. That's his bread and butter. You have to crowd him out on the perimeter. Lillard outside. Banked it in off the glass. And the Trailblazers lead by 12. More points coming from inside. In that respect, they've been the more aggressive team. Conchar off the mark. Had a chance there to trim it to single digits. Pass to Eubanks. Lillard with the ball. Here's Little. Yes! Great play by Lillard to set it up. Lillard's got six assists now in the game. And small forward Nasir Little. Just one season with the Tar Heels. He was the number six recruit in the high school class of 2018. But one year later, Grant slid to the 25th pick. NBA, he's showing signs that he probably slid too far. A long wait in the green room, but that's just one day. It's all about the work he puts in every day that will determine what he makes of his great potential. Now here's Lillard. Give him 20. From the right block, Conchar pulls it in. Conchar's got five rebounds in the game. And here's Brown for three. Knocks it down from distance. Three. Brown's got 10 points in the game. This is the shot you want to get him. An open look from range. Here's Lillard. Oh, oh, did you see that finish? Oh, oh wow. Dame just oh, sticking it to the other team. And you can see it's motivating his squad as well. A lot of set to get free t-shirts. Let's see who's the loudest. Your Blazer Dancer. So for the Blazers, Hart's checked in for Little, and it's done in for Damian Lillard. And now around two minutes gone by in this half. Goes up from the top of the key. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Left side, Winslow. And a miss there on the triple. It's tough to get open in this league. And when you do, it hurts not to capitalize. Brown can't hit. It's hard on the wing. Pass to Bledsoe, launches a three. He drops it from range. Well, points for him. He's been so aggressive on offense. And with the results, you understand why. You know why? Success breeds confidence. And he's certainly well, been successful well, from there, time and time again. A dozen consecutive points off of threes. This defense looks rattled. High arcing shot. Here's Eubanks. Misses the layup. Here's Brissett. He's off on that one. And it's Portland the other way. Dunn attacking. Conchar pulls it in. Conchar's got his seventh rebound here tonight. From outside the arc. Rebounded by Dunn. They keep calling his number, which is partly how they've dug this hole. A moment to hear from Allie LaForce. Thanks, Brian. Last season, Draymond Green called out what he saw as a double standard. When players ask for trades, they're vilifying. But teams can announce they're planning to trade a player and sit him on the bench in the meantime, and then it's taken in stride. Guys, he feels like it's disrespectful. Well, that's something to consider, Allie. Thanks. Good stuff. Out of bounds. It'll be Trailblazers ball. Portland ball. And now a chance to see what's coming up for the Portland Trailblazers. On Sunday, they'll be matching up against Steven Adams 
and the Memphis Grizzlies. Then on Monday, the Houston Rockets come to town. And looking at the Dallas matchup, it's going to be a very tough one for them. They'll need to be playing at their peak if they're going to steal the win. Hey, fans, who wants a free T-shirt? Make a little noise. All right, look who's coming out on the court. Come on, give it up for your Blazers answer. Lamore's checked in for Portland. Simons comes in for Bledsoe. And for players these days, a lack of shooting can be a big hindrance. Grant, would you be more concerned by struggles from the perimeter or the free throw line? I'd be more concerned with struggles at the free throw line. I mean, if you struggle there, you can become very, very tentative out there on the court. And opponents can foul to force your hand. First half, no good. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. Here's Hart. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. It's going to be on Bruce Brown. I don't mind that. I mean, they met him at the rim and temporarily prevented the point. No good on the free throw. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Ingles is checked in. Good on the second one. Defended by Dunn. Outside, Brown to the paint. On the wing, Conchar. Let's it go from deep. Rebound by the Trailblazers. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Now here's Dunn. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Eubanks in the high post. Shot clock at six. Hauled in by Brown. Woo, that's just a case of bad defense and even worse offense. To the inside. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It goes on Josh Hart. And a look at how the offensive approach has been going so far for the Trailblazers. What tremendous passing we've seen from them today. A very unselfish performance all around. Another thing, they haven't missed a beat on the fast break in either half tonight. Free throw good. Brown. And both free throws good for Brown. And Portland has possession. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Here's Eubanks. He has six. Two minutes remaining in the third. Two minutes. Clock at six. Down low. And down it goes. Whoa, Dumped it through off a beautiful setup. Woo! Defensively, you can't afford to let him get to the rim that easily. Well, that might be why their deficit is what it is right now. It's a backbreaker for your defense, giving up easy buckets like that. Now here's Dunn. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Outside Hart. Eubanks the screen. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his first personal. And he drops the first for the Trailblazers. Little comes in for Ingles. And Damian Lillard subbed in for Dunn. And so he makes both from the line. A minute 20 left in the third. Pass to Wagner. Oh, it's stolen away. Here's the break. Here's Lillard. And the dunk by Lillard. <laughs> Just so lethal in the open floor. I mean, Lillard is impossible to keep up with given his speed and athleticism. Danger time. Your laser dancer.
A minute six left in the third quarter. Holiday from long range. That one's good. He's now eight for 13. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Look smart when the shots are going down. Now here's Lillard. He's got 24. Right side hard. Five to shoot. The shot, no good. Here's Coffee. Outside Holiday. Here's the three. Out of bounds. It'll be Portland's ball. This is what we talk about valuing each possession, avoiding those kinds of mistakes. We've got 28 seconds left in the third quarter. Out to the right wing. Back to Lillard. Finds the bottom from 13 feet out. Lillard's got eight here in this quarter. And from the mid-range area, they've been the more effective team. Lillard against Holiday. Pass to Bates Diop. This one for three. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Holiday. Holiday's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. And so it's Portland. A sizable lead of 14 at the break. They just can't miss right now. Every shot they're taking, you assume, is going in. More 2K action in just a moment. Your Blazer Dancer. And now we have a moment to reveal our State Farm assist of the game. He's always near the top of the list for this honor. I mean, passes like these are his specialty. This is what you need your floor general to do. Take charge, lead by example, unselfish play. Well, there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter. But stranger things have happened. We've got Tony Bradley, and it's Coffey in a two-guard. Here's McLemore. Sends it home from three-point land. McLemore's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Holiday from long range. Connects from downtown. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. So it's Portland now. They led by as many as 18. Pass to Lillard. From deep. And again, it's Portland with a three. One this half, two for the game. Staying active from beyond the arc. Here's Coffee. Inside. Here's Bradley. Another shot. And it's in there. Tony Bradley. Bradley's got his first basket of the night. It's interesting. They definitely had more three-point attempts in the first half. Not sure why they went away from it. Here's Lillard. And the dunk by Lillard. Even with the score as it is, he just keeps coming at you. Holiday from long range. An absolute bomb from three-point range. Holiday's got 26. Efficient performance from him. Not the case for everyone else on his team. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth. McLemore gets the bucket. Exchanging buckets from downtown. That's been a staple of tonight's game. Hey, players love competition, and the fans love it as well. One side is dominated tonight. Yeah, they've done a fantastic job of imposing their pace and style of play. Pass to Lillard. There's the three. Coffee grabs the board. Lillard's got two of his six threes to go. Watford. That three's off the mark. Bledsoe goes in. Here's Little. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Bledsoe. Bledsoe's got his fourth assist with that last one. Pass to Bradley. The three is up. No luck on that one. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. And Lillard gets it to go. He's carried much of the scoring load tonight. And with the win in reach, don't expect him to let up. All right, fans, get on 
your feet. Make some noise for T-shirt time. All right, look who's coming out on the court. Come on, give it up for your laser dancer. If you're just joining us, fourth quarter here. We're just over two and a half minutes into it. To the paint. Back to Lee. Pass to Jackson. To stop the run. Rebounded by Dunn. They really have a commanding lead. Not just in points, but in rebounds as well. Now here's Winslow. That shot off. Wagner with it. Launches a three. And it's Portland with a rebound. Dunn's got his fourth rebound in this one. Pass to Little. Ooh, excellent D there from Jackson. Here's Lee. He tries for three. Drains the triple. Lee. Lee's got his first three points of the game. Fourth quarter of play, and over three and a half minutes have gone by now. Dunn right side, down low. Here's Bledsoe. Coffee grabs a board. Very surprising. He gets the ball where he wants it in a decent matchup. There's Jackson with the three. Knocks down the long chain. You just can't afford to leave open shooters in this league. Everyone is practicing the three. It's T-shirt Bonanza. Make a little noise. Your Blazer Dancer. Player of the game, Damian Lillard. This is special. We are witnessing a legendary performance here tonight. He is like levels above everyone else on the floor. Something must have clicked for him in warm-ups tonight. He's just come out and he has run wild. You know, after a long and painful streak of losses, they needed this pick-me-up. He showed that it's never too late to play hard and get back in the win column. Adds to their lead. They've been able to rely on him all night. Back to Lee. Pass to Windler. Here's Coffee. Winslow defending from 11 feet away. Coffee can't get it to go. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. I have to admit, I mean, it's always a tough decision for the ref on the block charge call. Team foul. Checking in for the away team. Pass to Winslow. To the left wing. It's Winslow on the wing. Six on the shot clock. The rebound by Brissett. Brissett's got five rebounds in the game. Now Holiday from deep three-point range. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. Winslow's got six rebounds here tonight. Pass to Eubanks. Now here's Lillard. Not a lot of room. And he caught Ooh, that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. Uh, really feels like they're in away, control. Team. They've got a big lead with time dwindling. Reason why they've tightened up the vice grip a little more each time up the floor. We'll see if they can close Your this one out. Laser. Thank you. 
Watford, Josh Jackson, Dylan Windler, Saban Lee. And there's a minute 45 left to play in the fourth. No coverage Josh that time. Jackson. Where was the perimeter D on that one? You have to guard against all possibilities. Bledsoe outside. Driving in. Goes back up. Lays it up and banks it in. And the Trailblazers lead by 19. And the distance between the point totals for these teams tells the whole story. Just a fantastic effort, and you have to give it up for the Trailblazers. Check out their assist numbers. They didn't get stuck in isolation. They got the ball to the guys who had the best matchups. And they'll chalk this up as their third win of the year. And against a non-conference opponent, you really want to win the first one. They'll go into the next one knowing how to beat this team for sure. And of all the highlights and performances we've seen here tonight, the one thing that stands out is what an unbelievable night it's been for Damian Lillard. You love to see this kind of leadership. Directing traffic, keeping everyone happy. He was the straw that stirred the drink. For the Trailblazers, Ingles, he's checked in for Little. McLemore comes in for Bledsoe, and it's done in for Damian Lillard. Here's Lee, defended by Dunn. There's Jackson with the three. Pure from three-point range. Great timing. That can be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Now here's Dunn, guarded closely. Pass to McLemore, 4-3. That shot, no good. There's Jackson with the three. Knocks down the triple. They're on a little run right now, but I'm wondering, where was this energy earlier? Well, the question becomes, are they playing that much better now, or has their opponent taken the rest of the night off? To the inside, Winslow. It's tipped! And he gets it back. That one Justice falls. Winslow. Back to Jackson. Perfection with the jumper Josh from the Jackson. elbow. Unselfish. Moving the ball. Love to see this kind of offense. So no problem for Portland as they get the win.